Yo, what's going on guys? Bobby here and today we are back with another video. Now it's been a long time. I just want to say don't mind the mic. I know it doesn't sound so good. We're still getting everything set up. I just moved back home after four months. So let's tell you guys what's happened while I've been gone. There has been a ton. Let's get right into it. So this video has been a while in the making. I didn't really know exactly what I wanted to do. So I'm just going to talk to you guys over some scrim gameplay. You guys can see it is my team versus CMG, a really good team in North America. And I'm just going to talk and let you guys know what happened. So about four months ago, my team, well, more than four months ago, but my team decided that we were going to move into a team house, the first ever team house in Brawl Stars, and live together. So that was a really crazy experience on your on your screen you can see tons of pictures we had a lot of fun it was really cool i've obviously met these guys tons of times but living with someone is totally different it was really awesome it was a cool experience and there are ups and downs a hundred percent as there are living with new people but it's an experience that i'm very happy i had and i got a lot closer with my teammates now with that being said while i was there i did not make any content now the reason i didn't make any content is a why, well, actually, that's not true. The reason I didn't make any YouTube videos is one because it was hard there You can hear everything through walls. I didn't set stuff up properly I'm not very tech savvy So it was really difficult for me to set everything up and do everything properly as you guys can hear with my mic right now And number two, I just didn't really have any motivation really to do YouTube you guys know I I truly believe that out of all the players that play and upload on YouTube. I am the best player and I think I can bring you guys the highest level of content and just the most insane level of content that any youtuber in Brawl Stars can give you guys but with that being said going into the competitive year my team had really high expectations team house is expensive and we did not start off very well now normally you guys are along for this adventure on YouTube I post wins losses whatever's happening you guys are as updated as can be but with that being said, again, no two, no YouTube videos, so you guys don't really know what's happening. Let's give you guys the rundown. So month one happened in BSC. We moved out west, as I said, and we lost. It was really close. We lost 3-2. We had a new coach, Peter, awesome coach, probably the, one of the best, co well, the best coach I've ever worked with. And myself, OG, Sans, and Zara, you guys all know who's playing. We played, we lost 3-2. It was really sad. It was really down, but we're very used to losing at the start. As you guys know, we're a very last minute team kind of pick stuff up at the end so I'm going to the second month we're hyped we put all of our work into this I worked really hard I had hundreds of hours in on just brawl in one month and we lost we actually got swept we lost in like 25 30 minutes it was really sad and we were actually put into a really difficult scenario because we had ESL coming up and what ESL is is a side tournament where there's a LAN, you can go to Japan if you make the grand one. So there was just a lot of important stuff coming up. So going into ESL, we came to the decision to no longer work with the coach. Peter's an awesome coach and I'm sure he's gonna get a really good job somewhere else. And we went into ESL, we ended up beating Tribe Gaming and the rest of the teams there, but, mo but mainly Tribe. You guys know Tribe has been our rivals for a long time and we won. Again, another NA LAN. We are the only team to ever win a LAN in North America. We kept that up. It was really, really awesome. So right after that LAN, we had another monthly final. And so when we beat Tribe, we had myself, Sans, and Zar play. So we decided us three were going to play during the monthly final. And we won. So we kind of got a little bit of our footing back. We were winning monthly finals. We were winning LANs. And when I'm starting to win stuff, and it shouldn't be like this, but when I win stuff, I feel more... Like I have something to give to the community. If I'm not winning stuff, I feel like what what difference am I from everyone else? I'm kind of just the same, but I have no viewers. I have no following. Uh, but I learned that isn't true. So after ESL in that monthly final, we ended up going to Japan. And this was one of the best trips in my life. You guys got to remember the people that I lived with, the people who are on my team, the org, they're like family to me. It's like going away and seeing your family and we had a nice big group it was a lot of fun japan was totally different obviously than north america or anywhere in europe that i've been or anywhere in south america that i've been and it was just an insane 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 experience you guys are going to get a bunch of pictures we swept crazy raccoon which is the best team in the world which was nuts never in my wildest dreams that i think i would beat them nonetheless sweep them tensai sai tempo and moya those are my three best players in the world and the fact that we were able to beat them i don't know that was just awesome you guys are gonna have some highlights on your screen of that 
but I don't know that was just a super fun time Japan was insane the food was amazing the people were amazing the scenery was amazing just everything about Japan was amazing and beautiful as of this month I'm the number one English streamer on Twitch if you guys don't go on Twitch it's the most fun thing ever it's awesome I really encourage you guys to go on it I used to stream at a really bad time for Europe but now I stream at an amazing time for Europe it's like 8 9 p.m. for you guys and kind of middle day for North America so if any of you guys want to check that out it's gonna be the first link in the description again I highly 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 recommend you go there there's tons of pro players there tons of content creators either in my chat or streaming on their on their own and I think you guys would love it and learn a lot now that being said Twitter and twitch has been awesome I've had non-stop support the entire year and now I want to come back on YouTube I want to do stuff big again I want to make the best possible videos now when I was making videos before and I've even scrapped two videos already that I made a couple days ago they just feel really bland now I kind of like those bland videos where I explain to you guys what's the current meta what's the best brawlers here what's the worst brawlers etc but I want to do actual high production videos I want to do really fun stuff and that's what you guys should be expecting coming your way a lot of long-term series is, I know I've said this before but stuff like Nuzlocke's stuff like a video I really want to do and I started working on is getting from bronze to masters in 24 hours in power league which is going to be really tough hitting number one in the world in multiple different things just a lot of high level gameplay that I don't think anyone else on YouTube in Brawl Stars can provide for you guys so I have a lot of stuff planned and I just want to say I do appreciate everyone that stuck with us for the entirety of the time I mean I've been on YouTube for a long time I know I seem inconsistent but I have over 250 videos I think over 300 videos at this point so it's not like I haven't been putting in the work I have it's been paying off it's gonna continue paying off and we're gonna take off together and hopefully we have a really big jump and start really crushing it on YouTube so moving forward you guys are gonna keep up hopefully with everything that I got going on we got a monthly final in three weeks that we're gonna be building up to I'm gonna get a ton of videos out I've been streaming power league every single day for hours and hours and hours this is the most competitive season that has been in probably over a year and I'm currently in second place so stuff's been going pretty well want it to go a little bit better obviously for us it's first or nothing so I don't know we're gonna play it out we're gonna see how things go but that's kind of my update to you guys I'm very excited to start making YouTube videos again. I hope you guys are excited to start watching again and expect a lot of great stuff to come on the channel soon. Appreciate you guys watching, whoever's watching. Appreciate the comments that you guys leave, the likes. It really does help a lot. And I will be seeing you guys in a couple of days. Until then, peace. Hey you. Yes you there watching this on your phone. Have you ever wanted to be the best? The most handsome? The most loved player on your team? and support your favorite creator at the same time. Well I have good news. You can be all of that and more, by using code Bobby. But you have to do it now because this is a limited time offer. Use code Bobby at any Supercell Games store.